Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kimi Madeline. This is my two year and four months update. On the 24th of March this year, 2016, I did a touch up surgery on my left eye to correct the haze that I got after my original surgery in 2013. Just to have a quick recap of what's been going on during these past two years, uh, I did a surgery on 12th of December 2013 um, on both of my eyes to correct uh, my eyesight um, and first uh, first of all it was all good and after five six weeks I started getting haze on both of my eyes which is basically um, you get like a scarring in the middle of the eyes so the eyesight gets a little bit more blurry and it's harder to see and um, yeah they try to improve those conditions with uh, cortisone eye drops and all kinds of like medical eye drops that tr they tried during those two years and um, recently end of last year they started to uh, suggest to make another uh, attempt at doing another touch-up surgery to try to remove the haze of the eye one eye at a time to to just start over again um, so that's basically what they did on my left eye for three weeks ago um, so the status right now is really good and it seems like it's heal my left eye is healing up just as it should I'm positive that there will be good results after the surgery because now three weeks afterwards my left eye is actually much much better than my right eye which was ironically my better eye from the beginning so yeah uh, when I'm looking outside I, when I'm looking at trees and I'm looking at a distance and looking at signs I actually can read much better with my left eye than I can do with my right eye so I think it's uh, improving slowly day by day and um, we'll see how it goes in May. I have my next um, appointment with the clinic in at the end of May so yeah I'm keeping my fingers crossed and um, hopefully uh, they will do my right eye eventually and everything will be done. So I'll be making these videos until I get the result that I was aspiring to get so I will keep you guys posted on what's going to happen and after all my appointments and what the status will be so yeah check back soon during these two years I've been reading a lot of studies on why people get haze in their eyes and I was really interested and intrigued by the fact that they um, didn't inform me of these kind of risks beforehand and um, I knew there were risks with doing an eye surgery but didn't know that people with uh, higher prescription b prior to the surgery would have like larger chances of getting haze and I read a lot of American studies and, and British studies regarding getting haze after uh, laser eye surgery and many of them had given advice about how to prevent it so i took those uh, things that i had read into consideration when going in for the second surgery so i read that vitamin c should be um, taken two weeks prior to the surgery and two weeks after the surgery in a higher dose so basically when you take like a multivitamin you take 100% of your daily dose in that pill usually so you will take around six to seven hundred percent prior and after the surgery so I've been taking vitamin C and I've been eating healthy during these days to kind of just make sure that my body will be healing from the out inside and also um, just making sure that I have all the nutrition all the possible ways to just make sure that my body will heal in itself so another tips is to buy really proper sunglasses prior to the surgery so you will have uh, full protection of while going outside even if it's cloudy even if it's sunny all days 
every time the sun is up you should um, have your sunglasses on so um, and you should allow your body to rest during the first week uh, yeah and that's basically it I tried thinking about these things this time and uh, not that I didn't do these things last time but it's just that I really didn't want anything to be interfering with the uh, healing this time so uh, that's all I have for now so if you have any questions please let me know in the comment section below and if you like these videos please subscribe to my channel and I'll talk to you soon bye